Hey guys, welcome back to Fur Fighters. Um, we left off here in uh, the museum. Sorry, that bear. <laughs> we left off in the museum. We did a few bits and bobs on the first floor down there. Did we get my baby? I think we did. If we're missing a baby, I know where he is it's in the cloakroom. I could have swore we got him. I don't actually remember. Between last episode and this episode, it's a couple of days, you see, so... I'll go take a look. Okay, so the answer to that question was yes, we got the bu the baby. Joy. Right, let's get back up. Okay, so I believe we finished this floor. So we don't need to come back down to this floor. Uh, the next two floors I know we haven't finished. Top floor I know for certain we haven't. So I'm going to go all the way to the top floor first. Because you need the second floor, or first floor, depending on where you're coming from. Uh, we need this. This is the floor we need to continue through to the very end of the level. So I'm going to go to the very top, and then you go through the back, and that will take you, believe it or not, down again, and out through uh, something at the back. Joy. Uh, but this, this windy staircase, it really is tedious. Well, it's not even a staircase, it's a ramp, but still, you got the point, you get the idea. It's a windy thing that's dull. There we go. And the fur fighters don't exactly run very fast. Something needs to die. There we go. That rock died. I shall be Tweak, because everyone loves Tweak. Right. Tokens, I see you. I remember where we are. Okay, so we are entering Bear Art. Ah, what are you doing? Not what I wanted. Creep strafing. They can't a hit a moving target. They have... L they really are stormtroopers. Mmm, <laughs> very snazzy. Ooh, wonderful. Oh, wow, this pit. No, I'm... <laughs> <laughs> I don't know what I'm on, guys. It's probably the coffee. Um, that will look like an invisible wall. How do you see an invisible wall? English! I knew you guys were here! I knew it! Seriously, though, who draws these? I guess the bears? I guess the bears draw these? Hi! Uh oh! Oh! Thanks for the help! Yeah! Oh, what? Okay. Shoot the bloody peacock! Thank you! As long as you keep moving, you're alright. And there's more of the goddamn things as well as we go along. Uh, there you go. That'll teach you. Can you get back up? Oh, you can't get back up. What a problem. No, but seriously, who draws these? Like kids have drawn them. Okay, so Tweak was there. I remember why. Die. That. That's how you shoot that gun. Ball of mineral wonder. Get ready to get deafened, guys, because this place is quite loud. Okay, so you got a giant asteroid meteor, whatever you call it when it's landed. Can't remember. Tokens in between them all. Yay! And bears. Lots of bears, or at least a single bear. Hi. It is allowed in the diamond room outside opening hours. I may be old, but I'm still sharp. You're not getting this key off me. I'm so old and useless. Yep, you do that, Mr. Pelican. Go on, back to your nest. Okay, you can stop the cutscene now. I don't know either, Tweak. <laughs> okay, you might have already figured out what you're supposed to do here. It's really not difficult. Let's see what Bristol says. To get that key, you'll have to do something about that negative attitude. Tweak! Yeah, you tell him. He's only a youngster. So, you've got to be positive. He's giving you a bit of a clue. Go away. That's what he does. He does that best. As you probably guessed, there's this thing here, 
which emits a, a signal, as, and so does that. I'm not sure which one, but it says magnetic meteorite. Okay, so it's a meteor, not an asteroid. So all you do is push it. Yeah, a little baby dragon is pushing a giant boulder. And it just uh, kicks the key out, and we can get in the safe. Da da da, come on, da da da. Pushing it away, just shooting. No, shooting doesn't make it go any quicker. How about fire breathing? No, but it's cool. There we go. Touching and cause them to be both the same, which makes the key go ding. Oh, I would have missed that, and I would have missed this one. I really must check you all of them, see if they're all got. Yeah, there's the key. So I've got the key, the exhibition key. So we can now go into the diamond room. This door open? Yes, it does. Oh yeah, I remember now. That was strictly uh, in the strictly PS2 version. That door's there. It wasn't there before in the Dreamcast version, which is why I'm surprised by it. But we'll use that because that will actually be really useful. Hi, what's in here? Giant diamonds. You. Die. Yeah, Tweak is now a vandal. I'm hoping to get all the tokens in this single run of this place because it is huge. This place compared to the like the remainder of the game and the rest of the levels and stuff. This is one of the biggest levels. Not the biggest level. The biggest level is probably in the next. Um, yeah, in the next world. Na na na. Blow that up. Oh boy, it's a bear. Where? Where the bear? I heard him. I don't see him. I heard it. Uh oh. I could have swore I did. Oh well, never mind. Okay, so what's happening here is. Oh. Was it you? Eh, there we go. Right, we've got uh, the Rockfoot Diamonds there. There's a Tweak Baby on one, and there's a Chang Baby there. Now, if we touch those, out of the ceiling there comes giant machine guns. So we actually need to push these and get in that way. Nah, nah, nah. In. No, no, no. Just be careful we don't accidentally run for run through the, the lasers. Got to wait till the beams are refracted enough for you to do that. Then you can get in and save Swan. Oh crap. What have we done? But the baby! No! Crap. And that's got the wire. Sugar. Where's the exit? Where is it? I don't know where it is. It's that there. Okay, cool. Showing you what happens if you touch it. Yeah, you don't want to touch it. You really don't want to touch it. Run! <laughs> Proof that you don't want to touch it. <laughs> Yeah, never touch that. It's not a good thing. Bad things can always happen if you do. Okay. Oh, fudge. See, these are easier to kill than a bear with a gun. Oh, where'd he go? Hello? I would have been very bad then. Okay, so there's no tokens here. I can... I'll go, I'll go this way. I've never been this way, and they probably have put some tokens here. So I'll go this way and see where it takes me, because I can't actually remember. I, I think he uh, Chang is the fastest ground runner, so we shall see. I believe this is taking me down the ramp and roughly where I need to go. Let me see. This should come out in the cinema. Yes exactly where I needed to be. This is exactly where I needed to be. So this is actually just sped up the video quite a lot. 
Okay, if you remember, uh, I'll show you roughly once we've, 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 uh, once we've done with this. Teeth, put them in. So we have some switches at the back. We also have a big switch at the front. I believe it doesn't matter who we use here. Come on, Chang. Thank you. And then there's another one there. There we go. Right. Tweak, you're mine again. Okay, now we need to pay attention. Push the button. Would you like to know what my favorite things in the world are? Come a little bit closer and I'll share a secret that you'll find useful. Don't be shy now. I am going to show you a series of images. The three images represent my three favorite things in the world. Reveal them to you a number of times. The amount of times I reveal them to you indicates how much I like that particular thing. Just tell me in reverse order what my favorite things are, then I will let you into a little secret that only I know. Did you catch that? If you can tell me what my favorite things in the world are, I will let you into my useful secret. Okay, reverse order. So least favorite to favorite. So I think it was bowl, wool, cat. Can't remember. Yeah, bowl, wool, cat. Ah, well done. Now you know so much about me, I will let you into my little secret. The combination to the museum main vault is six anti-clockwise, two clockwise, four anti-clockwise, six clockwise. And that's the code to get into a giant vault in the bottom of the place here. Right, uh, this, if you remember from the last episode, takes me out to cat art, which brought me here. This is the next bit we need to do. Uh, we are coming up towards the end of the museum. You still, you still not got the scale of this place yet, have you? <laughs> it's quite big. I mean, I know there are a bit bigger levels in modern day games, but back, back when this uh, game was out on like the Dreamcast and whatnot, this was actually a huge surprise because I'm not used to levels of such length. Okay, this is an entire puzzle I have to climb, and boy, doesn't it get infuriating! because there's a boat that can instantly kill you. That. And yes, the bar stewards put tokens here. And I've got to be careful that that boat doesn't smack me in the face when climbing this ladder, because it can do exactly that. So this is a really difficult thing. Okay, so what we need to do is get on these giant waves first. No. Stay on them, please, bungalow. Then the boat. Then the arm. Ugh. And you can get crushed, so be careful you don't get crushed. So then we go there. You go to Juliet. And from there, we need to get onto his bottom jaw. Up there. On there. Doing really well so far. Climb Vigo's face. And then land on the helicopter. La da. And try not to lose your bearings as you do a jump. There we go. Whew, we got Bridget. And I believe we got most of the tokens from that. I don't know if there's any more. Jeez. Okay. Okie dokie. Okie dokie. I will now fall. That hurts. Right. Luckily, there are food around. So you can pick those up if necessary. I think I got all the tokens in here. So down we go. But I know that there are fast ways back up now with that giant staircase because this takes us down here. So this is going towards a basement sort of section. Go away. Uh, beetle shield. Mine. Whoa. Nah. Kaboo. There we go. Done those. That's another Juliet there. Jeez. Cool. Right. Next bit. What is this bit? What is this? Oh, I really hate this bit. Oh boy. Right, let's do this. They are very strategic in what they are, what they've done, because they've put one of the these up quite high. 
That's that one dead. Oh boy. And they're all over the place. It's not just here, they're all over the place. We're in a warehouse, I would imagine. Ah! You can hear them, and they're all over the place, and they're going to annihilate me. Hey, you! You're the bomb! <laughs> one liners I should never do again. Bye! Bye! Hello? How did the. <laughs> How are they not killing her? Oh, Juliet. Okay, okay, okay. Let's not mess around with the lady that has a rocket launcher. There's a good kitty cat. Yeah, let's not mess around with the lady that has a rocket launcher now, shall we? Yeah, let's do that. That, that clearly works. Okay, we'll try one last thing, which is... Bah! How are you not dead? Eh! Jeez! Did you sign a deal with the devil or something? Okay, there's a ladder somewhere. I don't know where. And you need Tweak to get in all of these boxes. And you can easily miss tokens here. So be cautious. Alright, so we climb this ladder to start off with. There's a token here. Okay. I think she can jump. Yeah, she can just about jump most of this. I think. Unless Bungalow is behind me. I think he is. Is he? There. No, he's not. Okay, so how do I jump across most of these? Because I haven't seen Bungalow in here. Hmm. Okay, can I make that? I can. Can I make this? I can. Tweak, are you up here? Ooh, lol. Rockets. I need rockets. Launch your ammo. Where's Tweak? Tweaky! I have seen another fur fighter in here. Who was it? And where was it? Oh, over there. Okay, cool. That's Tweak. Okay, we should get to him. Uh, Tweaky, how do I get to you, sir? Ah! Juliet, do not fall. Ah! Okay, this is infuriating. How do I get to you, mister? I can't remember. And yeah. Okay, we've dump jumped over there. Leap! Oh, I can make it. This is just awkward to angle. Okay, I'll get all these, but I'll use Tweak. Much easier, because he can glide between places. Right, Tweaky boy! Blech. All right, okay. So we have a baby of his to get. I believe the rest of the babies are Tweaks. I believe they are. Not certain. Okay, Tweak up there. There's a good lad. Then you can get up here. And then up here. So you just got to jump around from crate to crate like this until you have them all. But be cautious, you could miss some. This is probably the most likely area I will miss a token, if anywhere. Because there's multiple levels to this place. So I have to check that. Mr. Luik. And you may have gathered, we're going through the letters of the alphabet just with the word week after it. So we've got Luik, Dweek, Week, Queek, Sweek, things like that. Ah, tokens there, you see. Ha ha. Token there. Any more for any more? Don't see any. There's one there. One there. Got ya. 81. 19 left. Okay. I don't actually think there is 19 left down here, but there's a possibility. See ya. Overkill for a single bear, but it's funny. You've got the ammo, use it. Ah, fire! Oh boy. Oh no, <laughs> I remember this. Okay, so we're in the boiler room. Get ready. Help! I've always stoked the boiler! It's gonna blow if you don't help me relieve the pressure valves! Okay, so we are in a timed puzzle. You should probably can gather. You've got to run and push the buttons in the allotted time. 
or the boiler blows along with you. Button. Now quickly run to the next bell. Just keep an eye on where you think it's roughly going to come from. I assume it's bottom up, bottom up. So you go bottom top, bottom top, because I don't think they'd put two on the bottom, because if you've got a time limit, it's going to go down, up, down, up. So the best thing to do is just run back up, find out which one it is, and then push the button. Quickly, it looks like it's going to blow at any moment. I'm going to blow you up in a second in a minute, you silly prat. Okay, just jump off, glide down, and then run around with strafe. And it's one of them down here. Yeah, it's you. Sheesh, thank you for <sighs> Now you can continue your adventure, and I can return to my life of unending domestic drudgery. Yay, he opens the rest of the museum for me. And Tweet gives you the look of, what the hell was that? Are you asking me, Tweet? I clearly have no idea. I think you were supposed to use Bungalow for this for some reason. But I don't know why they gave you Bungalow, because he has no use in this place. But I do it because uh, when you transform into a different fur fighter, it saves the it saves where you are. There's Puik. Then we've got one more baby, which will be the one on the diamond. So yes, the re remaining ones are Tweak babies. I love how I say Tweak's baby. It's not Tweak's baby. We need to remember this, because Tweak's just the day old. You what? Hey, pistol! At least he's better than a stormtrooper. Yeah, get behind there, Tweak. Bye bye. And stupid bear. Oh no. Oh no. Hi. Oh. Oh. oh, that was a good shot. Oh, 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 how am I alive? Okay. Hi. I can see, oh, I can see more tokens through there. That's good, that's good. And there's more tokens in here. So there could still be 19 or so. Okay, this is why you need Bungalow, isn't it? You need to have him in here to get up these boxes. And then you get tweak it in a bit. I remember now. Bungie! Where was he? He was over here, wasn't he? Mr. Bungalow, sir! Ah, there he is. <laughs> Woo! Alright! Mr. Bungalow! Bouncy, 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 bounce. Up we go! Okay, one, two, three, it's 84. Again, just double check all the crates and everything, because the game loves to hide things in little nooks and crannies. It's what it does well. Can I get up there? I don't need to, because I've already got the launcher, but... Okay, so over here, over here. Anything down there? Pet yums. Okay, there and there. Jump to this one. And then we've got some pet yums here. So we've got 87. 13 tokens left, and I don't know if there's 13 tokens left down here. There could potentially be, because I do remember some other places the tokens are. Pop! Well, I hurt those, so coming out here. Whoa! <laughs> they were closer than I thought they would be. Oh, I remember something. One moment. That person is up there. See, what they're trying to get you to do is run, aw run away. Okay, let's... Uh, okay, that works very, very well. That works very, very well. Run, Tweak! Ah! Okay, Pr preservation. Uh, no! Come on in then! Oh, 
Oh boy. <sighs> Tweak's about dead. And I don't actually have a sniper route this in this game. But I got her, thankfully. Up we go. I need some food. By the way, sneaky token back here. Don't forget the sneaky token. I forgot the sneaky token a few times. Don't you be the one that forgets the sneaky tokens. Oh no, there's food! I wanted that food. Am I am I gonna am I am I going to get it? No. No, I'm not. I'm probably going to regret that, but no I'm not. I'll just turn into Rufus first. Rufus! Why are they giving you Rufus? I genuinely have no idea at this. Let's not use the rocket launcher. Goodbye. Ooh! That was shotgun to the face. Sorry, not sorry. Okay, there's nothing up there. I can't hear Rufus, baby. 94. We're doing well. You watch there be one token I'm going to miss. <sighs> so, that's the vault we need to open. Pretty impressive vault, but you can probably imagine that's where the diamonds went because you can hear the baby. So, it descended back into the vault. Okay, I need to get over there. Why? Why Rufus for this bit? Okay, Bristol. Open the safe by turning the dial to the correct number. I know. I know. Yes, yeah, shut up. Shut up. I'm trying to get past you. Oh. How do I get those? Tweak's probably going to glide over to them. I I want to do it. I want to do it as Rufus. Come on. There's life in the old dog yet. Let's go. Mr. Bristol, shut your face. And, and, yeah, I'm not going in those, screw those, uh, but, back, there we go, so we got the token, sorry, just itching my nose, now we have to do this, so, the numbers need to turn six anti-clockwise, so against the clock would mean, not that way, <laughs> That way, so six, two, four, six. That work? No. The other way around them. So six, two, four, six. Did that work? No, we did not. Six, two, four, six. There we go. Jeez! No! What? Oh boy, danger is coming. Hide. Oh! Danger's there. Okay, at this point, you need the pistol because it has the range. Oh, I. <laughs> Killed by a pistol! Sprint for your life! Eh, 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 eh. Oh god. Oh, bears everywhere. Bears everywhere. Where's Tweak? Where is Tweak? Eww, not what I wanted to hear. This vault had a lot of people in. Yeah. No. Yeah. God, this gun is powerful, but slow. Whew. One. Two. Oh, God, I've got a nasty feeling I'm missing one token. Because there's two the other side. Where's the last one? No, why does the game always do this? One. Two. Yeah, I'm on 99 tokens. The hell. I will find the last one. Hello. Okay, I don't think it's over here anywhere. Just double check this room. 
missing one now. And this place is a nightmare to check for tokens. It really is. It could be anywhere in this whole museum. That... Oh, that's an episode in its own to find. It really is. Okay. I don't even have Tweak, so I need to go back anyway to fetch Tweak. Okay, there's Tweak. And while we're here, just double check. See if we've missed any along this section. Because there's a second bit up there that I haven't been to. Let me just go in there and see. It could be in there. I would like it to be in there is more of what I'm trying to say here. <laughs> I am not really wanting to go searching the entire museum for one poxy token. Is it in there? Hello? No, it's not. It's not. Everything but. Is it in here? Did we miss it anywhere in here? Ah, no. Just double checking while I remember. Ooh, okay, you're through there. Is it through here? No. <laughs> Goodbye, dispatching bears. Uh, no. It's not in here, is it? Ah, uh, damn it. Okay, what I will do is I will search off cam, and I will most likely at the beginning of next episode. Uh, post where it is because at the moment I'm on time restraints for the amount of things that I can record so we will go rescue the baby exit the level and you will have the new token wherever it may be at the beginning of the next episode and next episode will be the boss of New Quack City and once we defeat the boss of New Quack City we are moving on to the next world so um, next episode might not be that long so yeah, just in information there. I believe the one on the diamond, in case I accidentally skip the text, is called Boik. But we'll see. Yes, Boik. There we go. Because sometimes you can push the button accidentally and it sends it uh, into a fit of a fit of um. Oh no, you don't know. You don't want to know what this is. Okay. Ah! You meant to glide then. Okay, so we'll exit the level and we will end the episode here. Um. Yeah, that, that one token thing is sort of annoying. But yeah, I'll go find that uh, off cam, and I will catch you guys next time. Thank you very much for watching. I've been Sausage. This has been Third Fighters. Take care, and goodbye. Forty-nine minutes, ninety-three kills. 99 gold tokens and 9 babies. That one token!